up y'all it's day and i'm back with the hair tutorial i know i've been slipping it's been a few weeks since i posted a tutorial with my hair but if you guys have been keeping up you know i had something big going on if you missed it go ahead head back and check out some of my latest videos but anyway here with the hair tutorial today i'm going to be doing a jumbo rod set and i'm using that ali k naturals liquid gold if you guys are not familiar with the lemongrass leave-in from ali k I'm pretty sure we all are. That was a staple, is a staple in the natural hair community as far as providing actual hydration. So, Ali K Naturals does have an entire styling collection centered around that. So, I'm going to be using some of their styling products for this tutorial today. I've already shampooed, I've done my protein treatment, and I'm about to hop right into my leave-in conditioner. So, let's get into these curls. Okay, so first up is the lemongrass leave-in conditioner. Again, this is a natural hair OG staple. Like, this has been everyone's favorite leave-in conditioner. It is spray-on, and I personally don't like spraying products on my hair, so y'all saw me spray it in my hand and apply it that way. But it comes out creamy. It's not watery at all, like most leave-in conditioners that are spray-on. Now anyway, like the name says, the key ingredient here is lemongrass and on top of smelling sweet and having a refreshing scent, lemongrass oil actually helps strengthen hair, promote hair growth, and actually smooths the hair strands to provide a silky and shiny look. And y'all, I'm happy to let you guys know you can find these products in Walmart now. Shout out to Ali K Naturals for the expansion. Y'all know I love to support me some black businesses. So make sure you guys head to Walmart to pick up these products and support their new expansion. And as the title of the video says, I am doing a rod set today, so y'all know I had to go with the mousse. However, this is a styling collection and it does have a super twisting butter and a styling gel. Any of which could be used for a rod set, but I prefer mousse because it gives me fluffier and more voluminous results. With gel on my rod sets, I get the longest hold, and with butter, I get the most moisture. So for me, mousse is volume, gel is definition, and butters are moisture. You can't go wrong with any of them, but volume me, please. As far as the mousse goes, it is a nice rich mousse. It immediately softened my hair and made it easy to rod and run the brush through it. And for the rods, y'all see I'm using the black rods today. And real quick, the key to define rod sets for me is to make sure my ends are secure and keep tension when I'm rolling and roll it tight. For a very detailed video on how to perfect your rod sets, make sure you check out the video right here. Y'all, so I ended up running out of these black rods and the next biggest size I had was green, so I popped a few of those in there. And to dry my hair, I did sit under a dryer for about 30 minutes. For me, this helps the products penetrate better because I do have low porosity hair, but it is optional. You do not need to use a dryer at all. But after I dry, I do air dry overnight the rest of the way. So this is the next day and ooh, these curls are looking good. So it is time to separate and for a detailed method on how I do that, make sure you guys check out that video I just referenced. Now I am using the Sleek and Shine Finishing Oil. So just three products today for this bomb rod set. And you can get all three at your local Walmart.
and this is the final look y'all and it is bomb.com super fluffy and lots of volume if you enjoyed this video make sure you guys give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and cut those notification bells on and head down to the comments let me know what you think and give me some more products to review